And then nice. Hello guys, how are we doing? Well, let me just put it like this. War. War never changes. That's right, boys and girls. We are in the war. You know, there's Ukraine versus Russia, Israeli versus the Palestinians. But my God, the internet is taken by a storm right now. Kendrick Lamar versus Drake. And let's put it like this. It's almost as one-sided as a horse trying to burp. It's almost as one-sided as when the boys taking the girls in rugby. Because by God, Kendrick Lamar is winning. He is a champion, boys and girls. I honestly can't believe what we had to listen to, what we endured. Drake is ruined. He basically calls him a pedo. He calls him, says he's into minors, or specifically a minor. Drake didn't really have much else to say in response. I mean, I don't think Drake can write his own name out in full. And I don't mean Drake. I mean, whatever he's called in real life. So I, I, I really don't think Drake Drake's written any of these verses or written any of these songs in the slightest. No no way, Jose. And if he did, then it's time to hang up your, your, your microphone, mate, because it was dog. It was absolute rubbish. Poop, manure, caca. But yeah, like, but you know, who cares? You're right. I agree. I don't give a fuck. I'm here about the memes, bruh. I'm here about the memes, bruh. You can literally see Millie Bobby Brown's trending and we're going to get into why in a sec. I am why. I am a fucking clown. I did have a question relationship with Millie Bobby Brown. <laughs> <laughs> Get it? Because he had a questionable relationship with Millie Bobby Brown, apparently. I don't know if it's true. So J. Cole's obviously here while uh, Kendrick... Because obviously J. Cole and Kendrick had a bit of beef and it lasted like one night, I'm pretty sure. And J. Cole apologised and said, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Please. I regret it. I regret it. And then Kendrick Malar, Lamar went on to the, well, do this to... Uh, Drake slain the fool or well, Jay Cole's got to sit there on his little bike and cry and he just leaves him be just knowing what could have happened to his arse cheeks if he decided to pursue it and attack him. I was young girls, I promise. So Kendrick Lamar said that in Drake, The Heart, Part 6. So that's one thing you'll notice as well. A lot of people are coming out and saying all these things. So an another thing that's quite interesting. Another thing that's quite interesting. Apparently he says that he made up loads of information and knew that uh, Kendrick would fall for it. Uh, uh, he's just an idiot. I honestly think Drake is one of the most overrated human beings in the entire galaxy. Drake linking with his ghostwriters be like... I didn't realise it was even a conversation. I always... Holy shit, I've seen always sunny but the dude on the left whatever his name is getting rob McElhaney, he's putting a bit of chung did didn't he god damn it's assumed we would be heavily involved this yeah, is bad. Right. we gotta definitely write a song about how we, we do not diddle kids do not diddle kids it's no good diddling kids <laughs> drake no i don't touch minors i only have a question relationship with millie bobby brown who was at a minor at the time but she's in stranger things so like she's kind of an adult there's no quicker way for people to think that you are diddling kids than by writing a song about it you gotta write a song that says oh i wouldn't do it with anybody younger than my daughter no little kids gotta be big older than my wife my daughter something like that <laughs> Brilliant, isn't it? It's literally like literally Drake coming up with excuses as to why he doesn't diddle kids. Like, no, I, I, why do, why do you have to say you don't touch kids? Does everyone else touch kids? Unless you clarify, you don't touch kids. And look, I think this is dumb. A brilliant. Bring up Millie Bobby Brown on the track when Kendrick never mentioned it is the most telling slip up. <laughs> it literally is. So I, what do you mean, minors? I never did anything wrong with Millie Bobby Brown. What? Who, who mentioned Millie Bobby Brown, you pedo? Get to Epstein's Island, you frick. J. Cole probably feel like one of them people who missed their flights on 9-11. <laughs> He's Seth MacFarlane this shit. Honestly, he probably does. He's like, damn, I actually dodged a bullet here. Kendrick, you're a pedophile. Drake, you got molested. So notice how he doesn't deny being a paedophile literally that's a great comment and um, you know drake is like one of the biggest artists ever you know what i mean i've never been a drake fan i'm not i never have i think i like one of his songs and it's when rihanna sings most of it um i've just never have been i'm not a huge kendrick lamar fan you know what i mean i like some of his songs but not really like i wouldn't ever put him on but kendrick lamar absolutely bent this boy over and bashed his booty in because oh my god the internet has chosen sides and considering drake i would say is probably the most popular out of the two You'd think it's not that way anymore, boys. Kent Drake's been ruined. 
He's been dunned, absolutely spankled. So you got, you know, idiots like the Rolling Stone. It's hard to care about a rap war when there's a real one going on. Bro, there's wars going on all the time. You just don't hear about them all the time. And now it's free Palestine and fuck Drake at the same time. Ain't hard to say both. <laughs> fuck Drake. Fuck Drake. Drake is a pedophile. I never touched Millie Bobby Brown. <laughs> you fucking annoyed Barbie, man. Not even Barbie's impressed. You're a pedo. You're lying. I'm attracted to Millie Bobby Brown. Who said anything about Millie Bobby Brown? <laughs> Oh, I love it. I love the beef. I love the arguments. I love that, in fact, Drake has basically ruined himself by getting involved with K -K 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 Kendrick Lamar. I'm going to hit you with a ba ba I'm barely even trying. Nigga, you are on your last breath. You, nigga, you like Piccolo in every episode. <laughs> <laughs> with your fucking shoulder hanging, nigga. You not fooling nobody. <laughs> <laughs> There's literally Drake, he's done. Drake's ghostwriter is really, they drop Millie even though Kendrick didn't mention her. <laughs> like, why would you bring someone up? Like, fuck. A minor. That's the best line because he's basically insinuating he's a paedophile and he's into kids. Looted. I ain't going to jail. <laughs> now I gotta pull up. Everybody dying, me included. I ain't going to jail. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> That's literally Drake's like, I'm not fucking going to jail. Drake putting on the meme, me, putting out the name Millie Bobby Brown and Epstein in reference to himself before Kendrick even mentioned them. Exactly, he's probably fucking, uh, uh, what's it called, Epstein's best friend, mate. He's probably funded the island himself. Do you like teenagers? When you say teenage, how are we talking? <laughs> Girls who are teenagers. Do you like kids? When do they stop being a kid? Drake, you are a pedophile. I'm too famous to what? be a pedophile. <laughs> That's basically what he said. One of his lines was like, if I was a pedo, I would have been caught. <laughs> I never touched Millie. You're obsessed because you were molested. Just doesn't look good for the bloke, does it? It just really, look, the memes are scrumptious. The, look, and there's this as well. He kisses an underage girl on stage. I'm not going to show it because it's like child pornography or something like that. Oh, God, I just showed it anyway. Fuck life. Anyway, Drake, hopefully he's over. We don't have to pretend we like any of his fucking songs anymore. He's done, he's dead, he's gone. Kendrick Lamar, whole rock on, dude. Write some more shit, just finish him off. You know, this guy's literally limping. He's on one, like this guy said, he's limping. He's limbless. He's nearly done. He's lying on the floor just begging for a bullet in the brain. Just finish him off. Absolutely ruined Drake's career. I'd love it if this was the end and Drake just... You know, dissipate. He disappeared. He also put said he was a paedophile loads and put nonce shit on his house. Oh, it's amazing. I'm not saying he's a paedophile, but why is everyone calling him a paedophile? It makes no sense. It makes no sense. Anyway, guys, let me know who you think won in the bottom. If you like both of the artists, I want to hear from you specifically. Like, do you actually think Drake's a pedo? Do you think Kendrick won? Do you think Drake won? Let me know, guys. Bye bye. And it's probably a minor.